Yeah. God's servant was just speaking in one of the deepest mm. aspects of God's will. Mm. Hallelujah. Mm. Did you get that? Mm. I call it the wind of God's will. That's what you heard right now. Because it's easy to go off to a lot of good stuff in God's work. And most folks in God's work are doing what I call, remember that place that, uh, that, that Jonah went instead of Nineveh? Yeah. They have Tarshish ministry. Their ministry is for Tarshish. They, they've gone elsewhere from where God sent them. And that's why God gave us this clear guideline as to his providence because God's providence is the highest level of God's will. We should put that in the back of our Bible. For God's providence will not change. Amen. Hallelujah. I was quoting a scripture to one of our men of God today in Proverbs 16, 33. And it says, the lot Give me that verse, my God, man. The, uh, the lot is cast into the lot, but the, this, the disposing is of the Lord. In other words, hallelujah. God is already doing it. You want to be in what God is already doing. And once you go into what God is already doing, you know we say you give me a room for you. Or uh, if you if you go into what God is already doing, you don't need gift. Now I got into trouble right there now. Because it's gonna come upon you. Come on, somebody. The lot is in the lot. What is happening because of God's providence? I saw somebody, I heard one person playing something last night, I ain't gonna tell you. I said, my God, only God can do that. Only God, I heard somebody playing a certain thing last night. I said, no, no, I, I, when I was finished, I went to those guys playing and said, you think it's you playing? Come on. I said, don't even lift up yourself. Come on. I told them it's Proverbs 16, 33. Because God is as do, is already doing something. And someone, he gets a hold to be in it. So all of a sudden, you don't have the best player, the best singer. Come on. And once you begin to be the best singer for God, you ain't going back. Come on. I heard a young lady sing this week. And then I said, wow. Come on. Come on, somebody here. Glory to God. Hear somebody say, I wonder if it's me. Yes, it's you. <laughs> Glory to God. Amen. It's because of what God is already doing. Are you getting me? And we get the privilege to be in it. So what's happening right now in, in Florida and other places? Come on. Is the disposal of God? Is the providence of God? Is the will of God? And all you have to do is to step in it. Come on now. And have the passion for it. Hmm? Because God has given the proofs of it. Come on. And walk in his purpose for it. And be willing to become the prophets in it. The pastors in it. The people in it. The positions being filled in it. By you. Gathering places for it and exercising the pull for it. Glory to God. And this is the wind of God's will. It's happening. You don't want to be out of it. Many things have already changed. Anybody heard of the wind? The Bible says in, in uh, John 3 8, it said that the wind blow it where it listens. Nobody knows where it comes from. And nobody know where we're going. What that means that it's, it's going to come from some place you never, ex you never expect. Uh -huh. Most folks will, will only move forward if it happens in the way they expect. From the place they expect. And from the persons they expect. From the uh, 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 situation they expect. From the platform. 
forms they expect. But when it's the wind, come on in. You got to recognize it without where it's coming from. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And you have to get in it when it arrives. Because when it moves, you're going to be looking for it and can't find it. And God has sent the wind to Florida. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And in this wind, in this providence, in this revival, God has designated natives. Go on, somebody. And settlers. And visitors. And we heard a preacher. God looking for what? People. To put you in positions. To be what? Pastor. Are you with me somebody? To be what? Prophets. To carry God's purpose. With passion. With pull. Are you getting any idea what's going on? It's all organized by God. You know why some people believe I want to say you are always say I'm going to give you the answer. I'm going to give you the answer. It's the simplest answer you'll ever hear. Why they believe that? Let me tell you why. Because God knows everything that is going to happen. He cannot help it because he's God. Come on. You go back to Proverbs 16, 33. It is posing there is the Lord. So God knew you would get saved. And God knew you would struggle. God knew that after a while you'll get over your drug addiction and then you'd run back to it. But then you would get out of it. And all your life till you die, God can't help but see it. So when you look in the Bible and see God's version, you call it one save or you say, You don't get me. Makes you can explain better. Do you hear me now? Come on. When you see God's version, because God says, if it was possible, they would deceive the very elect. Yeah. That means it's impossible yeah. to deceive yeah. who God already see complete, yeah. complete journey. Yeah. God already see your complete journey. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Because you God you see the end of your journey. Yeah. Are you getting me from yeah. Are you getting me somebody? Yeah. But, but you who know have to live your journey. So they put God's first on and call it one save or I will say. Holy Ghost. I believe I need to explain it better because I feel it, but I don't get it. And I'm doing a good job. So they are claiming God first on. And come on, I don't know. They have to get into their position. Romans 8. He said, Those who is for now. <laughs> I'm getting better right now. He said, Those who is for now. He can't help but know. And see the end of your Christian life. And you die at a hundred and twenty years old. <laughs> and I've 33 grandchildren. <laughs> and four great grandchildren. <laughs> But when you see that version, you must lift your version. Come on, somebody. And walk right in your version. And talk in your version. And praise the gospel. And pass to the church. Whoa.
of the week. Please, me, Father, we thank you for your people. 
We thank you, God, for your providence. The providential revival that's happening across the world. That's happening before our eyes. In America and different countries all across the world. And the disposing law is from you. Lord, help us, Lord, that we open our eyes and cast our lot in the lap. Do our part as your people, as your pastors, as your preachers, as your prophets, carrying your purpose. Yes, Lord, move on us, Lord, we'll not pull back. But your will, your will, your will, your will, the wind of God's will will be fulfilled before our eyes. I repeat the end in the name of Jesus. And I thank you for the victory right now. Now, those who want to be in God's will, those who want to cast your lot in the lap of revival, those who want to be in God's providence, just draw to the altar right now. Draw to the altar. Draw to the altar. We're going to let you go in about three minutes. But draw to the altar quickly. Let him have his way. Let him have his way. Let him have his way. I'm telling you, the things I'm seeing, it's only God could be disposing of it. Yes, it's only God. It, it cannot be explained otherwise. My God, these things are beyond human ability. These things are beyond human planning. The things I'm I say, my God, my God, my God. Just this week I hear such great news. Then by two days' time, uh, it appeared as if the news was not going to be great. But we held on to what God said. And when we discover how oh, they called to say it was greater news than the first good news. Glory to God, glory to God. God, and uh, there are things happening. We know there's attacks, and there's all kind of uh, 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 attacks of the enemy. But you want to be in God's providence. You want to be aiming in God's disposal. You want God's disposal to be on your life. You want God to to look ahead and complete it in His version. Amen. Pray right now. Pray right now. Pray about God's providential revival. I said, Lord, I'm in it. I'm in it, Lord. I'm one of the people. I'm one of the prophets. I'm one of the pastors. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I'm walking in my version. I, 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 I'm walking right. I'm talking right. I'm taking up the mantle. Go ahead and pray. Yes, Lord. I'm not going to joke around. Oh, I'm going to consecrate myself in fasting and prayer. Yes, for the wind of God's will. Oh, for the providential revival. Yes, Lord, I'm a native in Florida. Lord, I rebuke every distraction. I rebuke contrariness. I rebuke discouragement. I rebuke the drawback. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. And I step into the wind of God's will. I step into a providential revival in the name of Jesus. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray right now. Go ahead and pray right now. Lord, those who waited for this to come, and one way or, or, or the other, oh, they feel a struggle to arrive. I pray that work in the name of Jesus. I pray to every stronghold from off their mind in the name of Jesus that they will get into the wind. My God, because they don't know how long it's going to blow in this manner. My God, move upon them, Lord, that they will get in it all the way before it's too late. Move upon the natives. Move upon the settlers. Move upon the visitors. Yes, God, in the providential revival, in God's providential revival, move upon us, Lord. Move upon us. Move upon every brother, every sister, every whether they be a native, whether they be a secular, whether they be a visitor, Lord, that will fulfill your will, will step, my God, my God, my God, into the wind of God's will. We will step, my God, in God's providential revival. Revival. For the revival be won by God. Oh, yeah. 
no man can stop, no man can divert, no man can bring down. My God, my God, Lord, we give you praise. Lord, we give you glory. We thank you, Lord, that we're not doing something that can fail. For the whole disposing thereof is from you. The end of it is from you. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. At this time, I just want to hand over to our acting in the past. But we close off as he's led. Glory to God, oversee a moment. Get my microphone.